हे मेकर्स दिस इज थ्रोविन एंड इन दिस एपिसोड आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द न्यूली रोल्ड आउट फीचर बाय माइक्रोसॉफ्ट ड्यूरिंग फेब्रुवारी 2022 पावर बी आई डेस्कटॉप अपडेट नाउ वी हैव अ न्यू फॉर्मेट पेन फॉर पावर बी आई मोबाइल रिपोर्ट्स अर्ली ईयर वी डोंट हैव दैट फॉर्मेट पेन अवेलेबल स्पेसिफिकली और डेडिकेटेड फॉर मोबाइल व्यू अर्ली ईयर वेन वी आर डेवलपिंग मोबाइल व्यू रिपोर्ट फॉर पावर बी आई डेस्कटॉप वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज वी आर एबल टू यूज only the visualization along with the formats in the mobile but that was something which was really looking ugly when we open the report into mobile because in mobile layout the font looks too large or we are also facing couple of challenges now microsoft comes up with a solution here by introducing dedicated new format pen specifically for mobile reports now let's explore this feature in detail with me but before that if you haven't followed me on my instagram and twitter so far do follow me these are the platform where i am uploading short content on power platform so without further delay let's get started here i am on my machine and here i have opened one power bi desktop report this is one of the report which i have created over here i have different elements i have here one navigator i have here one shape and i have here multiple visualization now i want to design my mobile view report so for that i will go to the mobile layout before we switch to the mobile layout one more important thing Once you update your Power BI desktop, basically you need to enable one setting from the preview feature. For that, go to the Options and Settings and click on the Options. From here, click on the Preview feature and make sure that you have enabled the feature called Modify Visual Setting for Mobile Layout. If this is enabled, only at that time you will be able to see this new format pen for mobile. Now, I already did that. so i'm not going to do again and now i'm switching myself to the mobile layout from the view menu so just clicking on mobile layout and this is opening one blank mobile canvas for me over here along with that it is showing me all the page visuals which are available over here now let's try to do couple of thing so let's say we have added one page navigator into our report So I'm trying to drag that page navigator onto mobile layout. So you can see that the page navigator is looking like this. Let me just increase the size. So this is looking like this. But for mobile perspective, I just wanted to change its orientation. So you can see that we have dedicated format pen for the mobile layout. Select the visualization and then go here and just go to the grid layout. And now I wanted to make that change. as horizontal because in mobile layout i need its layout to be horizontal so let's apply that and this is looking like this let's just shrink its height and increase the width so this is looking like this which is nicer so here you can see that i have changed the orientation and when you select this particular thing you will be able to see this type of icon over here means this is the thing that has been different from mobile device now let's say whenever you are making any update basically you are able to see this type of mobile icon with respect to power bi icon which means that it is not inheriting the settings now if you change anything else like if you expand the style and let's say if you just change the font color means this font color is something which is different for this mobile layout so i just change that font color and you can see the icon appears immediately over here meaning it is not inheriting from the desktop now similar way we have one shape over here so now let's try to drag that shape over here now i going to change the shape for the mobile layout so expand the shape and from here let's make it with some other shape so over here we have the different options 
so let's make to the line so I'm selecting line from here and this specific rectangle is becoming line for the mobile layout right and we can see that it is not inheriting from the parent and we are able to see this icon over here as well so now let's arrange it properly so I'm just increasing its width and let's make it consistent over here like this now similar way I'm just dragging couple of more visualization over here so let's drag that so I'm dragging this one also I just wanted to add this one as well so let's add that also I need this chart so I'm just adding this chart over here you can adjust the height and width according to your requirement and you know this was the main challenge that we were facing earlier so you can see the title looks really ugly with the very high font so you need to select your visual go to the title section and just need to decrease the heading so let's make it normal and that will change the title in a normal manner and also one more thing like whenever you select any visual and let's say if you have made any changes for dedicated mobile layout when you expand it there is an option to clear mobile changes as well so once you do that it will set your visual at the default level right so this is how the dedicated format pen will work for the power bi mobile report hope this video helps you and values your time if you are for the first time to my channel make sure you hit subscribe and press the bell notification to never miss any updates from my channel if you are looking for training and consultancy this is the website and if you wanted to follow me on all my social media handles these are the links i also created one dedicated channel for short content as well as hindi content on power platform subscribe that channel and show your love over here as well with this this is Dhruvind signing off. See you in the next session with some amazing content. Till then, have a great day. Goodbye.